that shit that that rumors that possibly PSG might be done with Neymar? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, and, and guess who might get him? Chelsea. Chelsea. Yeah. I could see that working. I could too. But like... <laughs> I could see it working. Interesting. If, if they, Obviously, these are purely rumors. Who knows what's really going to happen? It's the footballing world. Anything can happen. The world is crazy. But if that were true, Neymar crazy. leaves PSG as out of the three Messi, Neymar, and Mbappe, he's the outcast at that point. Yeah. They would they would elect to essentially keep the older yeah. Messi and the younger Mbappe when ultimately this team was Neymar's. Yeah. 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 Crazy. Hey, you know my take, bro. Yeah. I've been saying it for <laughs> yeah, years. Yeah, yeah. PSG is Mbappe's team, not Neymar's, yeah. man. If they do that, that, that just solidifies it for no, me. No, and I think, honestly, when I saw those reports, I was like, I think PSG are finally seeing that now. Yeah. They're just seeing the inconsistencies. The, the He disappeared in that Bayern game. Right. Even, yeah. even though he was healthy, he disappeared. Yeah. It yeah. just didn't work. It's not working. It sucks because I love Neymar, but yeah. he did not come through in that Bayern match. And that's the thing is that in those big, big games, especially these last four years where – PSG have really, really pushed for the Champions League uh, title. Neymar's been nowhere to be seen realistically, man. Especially in their biggest chance against Bayern in that final. He was all right when that would have been the stage for him to take over and win PSG and himself a Champions League yeah. title. Yeah. So it just didn't happen, man. And I think PSG are getting yeah. a, a little tired of it. Yeah, uh, I, yeah I'd rather... Sell him, use that money to continue mm. building around Mbappe and continue funding Messi's time there. I think building around Mbappe and Messi is just as good. Yeah, so man. I really would go for that rather, especially given that Mbappe still has way more years left in the take for him. And he's just so much more durable as well than Neymar, man. That's the biggest that's, thing, too, is his injury big. history can get so tricky. He just misses almost a month or two every single year. And he went out with an injury in that game mm. in which Messi scored that game-winning goal. Out with an injury, probably won't show up in the next Champions League appearance. Jesus like, it's just going to happen again, bro. And yeah. it's been happening for like the past four or five years. That's, so yeah. it'd be crazy if they made that move. It would. Uh, it would. I think it would be a bit of a stain on Neymar's legacy because yep. I feel like you've always we've always expected more. We just always expected more. That era he had in Barca might have been the highlight of his club career. Honestly. And that's just crazy to think, given how young he was at the time. Yeah. I thought the PSG era would go a lot better for him. Yeah. Yes, he was very close to winning a Champions League with him, and he did do a lot to get them he there. Did, he but did. ultimately, he didn't do it. Yeah. Ultimately, he just couldn't do it. And instead, to be to end that era being shipped off back to the Premier League, which would be fun. Neymar and the Prem It'd would be, be fun. fucking fun. It'd be I would really love fun. it. It would mean that the reason that Neymar left Barcelona for, which was to have his own team, to be the guy, just ended up not working out. Yeah. It ended up not being the best move for him. And I don't know what that does to him mentally, what it does to his ego, if he'd be able to set that aside, if he'd be able to accept that he does need a lot of help to succeed. But whatever the, the realization is, if he ends up moving from PSG, it'll be a disappointment. It would. But man, you got me thinking. Of, you got me playing football manager in my mind, man. Because you could do a lot with that money. God. You could do a lot God. with that money, especially that cap space opening up salary wise, man. Fuck. Yeah, you no, could do yeah, a that's lot. The biggest, that, that's the biggest thing. Like you could get because right now they should do it. Man. They should do they it. Get way more than what they're getting. Right, because if you keep Mbappe, Messi as like creative feeders out wide or even centrally, you could ship off Neymar, who's just as creative but not a big presence offensively. As like a big striker, you could get a guy like Victor Osiman. Oh my yeah. god! And you'd have two dynamic oh. winger midfielders in Mbappe and Messi, and then you'd have a out and out clinical number nine to feed to. That'd oh be insane. My god, dude, that'd be crazy. Yeah, that'd be insane. Yeah, you could do a lot of that money, yeah, man. I'm thinking right now, yeah, that's <laughs> a lot you could do with that. Fuck, man.